Can't believe you got another girl pregnant. You should learn from your brother Chris. He parties every weekend and has gotten zero girls pregnant. Chris tell your brother how you stay safe. I f guys. Hey guys, welcome to our All You Can Eat Buffet. Now remember children under the age of 8 do eat for free, so... Oh, oh, it's a perfect, okay. My son also is a uh, 7. What? Dad, I'm 23. Sir, your son is clearly an adult Asian man. My son is a 7, okay? Ask him. Ask him if he's a 7. Okay, um, are you 7? <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm s I'm 7. <laughs> he eat free, okay? Yeah, yeah. Fuck. Fuck this job. Hey loser! What the hell did you just call me? I was just, I was just flirting with you. Oh, I'm sorry. What's up, you fat, ugly bitch? It's a boy. Wait, why isn't he crying? Oh, can I see him? Congratulations, my. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Man, <laughs> that was the Antichrist. That was definitely the Antichrist. That was not normal. All right, son. This is a lie detector. It's gonna beep every time you're not telling the truth. So I'll ask you again, were you at school today? I already told you, Dad. Yeah, of course I was. You sure about that? Okay, okay, okay. I went and had a beer with my friends. You see, this is the kind of behavior I'm talking about. I was never drinking at your age. <laughs> well, I guess he really is your son. Honey? What the f- so your mother tells me you're afraid of heights? No, I'm afraid of highs. What? Hello? Ah! A boy and a girl are talking and the boy says, I hate this new principal, he's so dumb. The girl says, do you know who I am? I'm the principal's daughter. So the boy replies, do you know who I am? She said, no. And he says, good, and walks away. One day a teacher asked the class, anyone who thinks they're stupid, please stand up. One little boy stands up and the teacher asked him, why do you think you're stupid? And he said, I don't, I just hate to see you standing there alone. Hey, what does A stand for? Arson. Oh, you're so good. Okay, B, what does B stand for? Barson. <laughs> what stands for C? Commit arson. Ooh. D. Don't come near me, I'm going to commit arson. <laughs> I raised you real well. All right, you know what's up. Three wishes, three rules. I can't make anyone fall in love with you, I can't bring back the dead, and you can't wish for more wishes. I wish the age of consent was 12. Four rules! Okay, guys, he's gone. What do we do? Let's break through the window. No, he'll just be waiting for us upstairs. What if we all pretend to be dead, then when he buries us, we'll just escape through the ground? No, we'll suffocate before we even escape. How about we hit the wall down? No, he'll hear us before we even break through, and plus this is a basement, so we're underground. What if I use my advanced bird mating call to summon an army of birds to break us out? Good idea, but again, this is a basement, so the birds won't hear you. Threesome! Forget about it. What if we just pretend that we lost our memory, then he comes back and thinks that we're- a GUYS! Party. It's four against one, right? So why don't we just wait for him to come back and attack him as a team? That's a... Horrible plan. Yeah, what are you thinking? Dumbest plan so I've stupid. ever heard. Exactly. Is why we don't not gonna happen. Where the hell have you been? Went for a drink with my brother. LIAR! Prove it! Because he's here in bed with me! So who is this slut you've been seeing? You about your son. He blew up the whole school. He killed all the staffs, all the students. Hold up real quick. My student asking me something. Take your ass back to your fucking desk. Okay. Yeah, but um, he blew up the whole school. He killed me. I'm dead. I can't even talk. He ripped out my vocal cord from my neck. I can't say a word. He even killed himself. I'm looking at your son dead right now. How did I kill me on the phone? How he lying? So the teacher motherfucking lying, huh? The difference between best friends and regular friends. Best friends can get away with a lot more than regular friends can. For instance, if I'm eating something and you know I'm about to finish it and it's like the last bite and my best friend goes and it falls out my hand, I'm gonna laugh. But now if my friend does that, oh, I might just kill you. The cemetery is hiring! The cemetery is hiring! Don't mind if I fucking do! Ugh, it's Johnny Big Feet. Hey, my feet aren't that big. Damn you, Johnny Big Feet! Hey, um, can people fly? That's a shame. Okay, they said they love you and they miss you a lot. Aw, I miss them too. Tell them I have to sell that shit though. 
Uh-uh, uh-uh. Tell that bitch not to touch, touch my shit at all. Okay. They said, do, do not disturb their belonging. That's not how they talk. What they really said. Yeah. Say exactly what the fuck I said. I need this bitch to know. They said not to touch their shit. See here? I knew the fuck he would say some shit like that. Because I'm not keeping that. That's dead people shit. I bet. I'm finna haunt your ass since you need a motherfucker to be around. He's... He's finna haunt you. Oh, I'm sorry. Hi, what can I get for you? Hi, can I get the chocolate banana smoothie? What's that one called? Um, the Choco Funtime Banana Rama Buzz. <clears throat> and what can I get for you? Yeah, could I just get this one here? Sorry, I don't have my glasses. You're gonna have to tell me what it's called. I killed JFK. We got it. Please, please on your head! Oh, so please, I need your help. Hi, sir, what's the emergency? My son has gone missing. Okay, sir, what's his name? Sir? Hello, sir. Sir, what's his name? Sir, I need to know your son. Shut up, I'm thinking. Ugh, it's been over an hour. These guys are the worst. Maybe you're the worst. Aren't you a pre-recording? Uh, aren't you a jerk? I mean, I, I, I didn't mean it personally. Everything's about you, you, you. I mean, it's been over an hour. Oh, it's been over an hour. This is you with a baby voice, because you're, you're being a little baby. Hey, now you're being mean. I'm sorry, man. I've just been really on edge lately. I think my girlfriend's cheating on me. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry to hear that. How dare you say that about my mother? Sorry, this, this is all pre-recorded. You didn't say anything about my mom, did you? If you press that button, you will receive one million dollars, but someone that you don't know will die. If I press it more than once, do I get more money? Well, yes, but then more people- Dum dum. Hey mom. Have you been crying? Don't worry, I just get like this when the seasons change and the uh, flowers pop up. Oh look, it's the ugly stinky boy back in my garden this year. Oh, what are you gonna cry? Make a TikTok about it? Okay, so get this. You make 10 meals, you're not a cook. You make 20 paintings, you're not an artist. But you kill one person! What happens to the music during a car crash? Does it stop? Or does it just... I got my driver's license last week. Have a great day. I want to divorce. Oh, my God. What did I just fucking tell you? Hey, loser. Yeah, you catch. Bullying is no joke. If you or someone you know have been the victim of bullying, this man is a freaking dork. That is a classic example of bullying. Nice one, four oh, eyes. Fuck off, dude. We now return to Stabbed in the Butt, the only game show where if you get the answer wrong, you get stabbed in the butt. All right, Bradley, here's your question. What is the atomic weight of nitrogen? <laughs> get him, guys! Stab him in the butt! Well, what's your problem? No problem. That's my problem. And what's the problem? I'm a problem solver. I need a problem to solve. Okay, your finances. Did you solve that? Oh, yeah. No problem. Okay, well, do you get enough sleep at yeah. night? No major insecurities? Yeah. You're happy with your family yeah. life? You're healthy? It, done. I've solved all of those. Well, you've solved all your basic problems. Now you need fulfillment. But I got my fulfillment solving the basic problems. And why aren't you fulfilled? Because I ran out of problems. Well, that's problematic. Probably. No, definitely. That is a problem to solve. What is? Having no problem to solve. Well, how do I solve the problem of having no problems? Well, that's not my problem. It, what's your problem? Knock, knock! Who is there? A mirror! I am lonely. I wish people would be nice to me. Your wish is stupid. Sir, is this your car? Nope, it's yours! <laughs> I'm looking it up on your laptop, alright? <laughs> the battery's dead. I'll look it up on my phone. <laughs>
Dad, I know this doesn't look good, but you gotta trust me, I can explain. Hi, uh, can I get one ticket for the movie? Yeah, of course. Which one? The movie. Oh, okay. Um, are you dumb on purpose? No. Then which movie do you want to see? The movie! Right there! I asked you, which one did you want to see? This one or this one? The movie too. Are you dumb on purpose? Oh! Okay. Um, well, you know what? Fuck you. Excuse me? Fuck you. The prequel to the movie. Fuck you, I excuse me. The sequel to the prequel to the movie. Your Honor, I would like to plead guilty and request the death penalty. This is, a uh, for a parking ticket. I know, I know. <laughs> so tomorrow, death penalty, or... What the fuck is wrong with you? What's up, bro? How's it going? Uh, not doing so good. My, uh, grandma just passed away. I I'm so sorry, man. I, I didn't know. You're good, bro. You're good. Did she live a long life? Not really. She was only 69. She died yesterday at 4.20 p.m. <laughs> Hold up, you're laughing? <laughs> no, I'm not. Oh, so you think this is funny? No, I don't, no, I don't. We're allergic to the language French. W we? Hey Siri, how do you say seal in French? Fuck. Fuck. This is a cute baby fuck with his ugly motherfucker. Hey, keep on my grandma, please. All right, I got you. Do not make any sudden movements. Do not reach for that gun on that table, because I know you're tempted. And if you comply, I will not harm you. Then, then I'll comply. Okay, all right, that's good. That's especially good for you, because, I mean, my aim and my reflexes are impeccable. Must have, must have been a draft. There's no windows in here. Some sort it's of not even windy out there. Paranormal there. activity. I know you reached for the gun, man. That's not true. Who do you think you're dealing with, okay? My mom told me. My dad owns Microsoft. Your family will never. Ah! 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 Yeah, we're gonna talk about what that was. I had, had a seizure. Oh my god, here we go with the lies again. You didn't have a seizure, all right? I saw something behind you. Oh, come on, you couldn't even see behind me. What are you talking I about? I was just Stop lying. handing you the gun. Handing me the gun? You were pulling the trigger. You, you, were, you were trying god to shoot me. You were trying to hand. kill me. Why, why do I even put up with this? You're just my like dad so beats me. Is this patient sexually active? <laughs> with your mom. Triple the dosage. But sir, that could kill him. Just fucking do it. What a beautiful view. Don't do it! Huh? Don't jump! You have too much to live for! I'm just up here for the view. Hey, is that Timmy? Yeah. Oh, I thought you did this years ago. Wait, what? Yeah, you've been alive this whole time? I'm pretty active on social media. Oh, I unfollowed you. Because you... Because I thought you were dead. Why does he think you died? Dude, sophomore year, the bathroom incident? What did you do in the bathroom? Shove it, shove it, shove it, shove it. Damn, that's embarrassing. Oh, God. How did he get through that? Dude, I'm standing right next to you. This is just how I talk. All right, we need you to release the hostages without harming them. Well, our clients want you to give them the money and let them escape. I'll handle this. Hey, what if we doubled what they're paying you? Will you stop? I'll take care of this guy. What if we tripled your salary? Would you stop? Yeah, nice try. You said triple? This box contains your greatest fear. Do your worst. I fear nothing. And that's exactly what's inside. Nothing! <laughs> Wow, our prisoners are running great this week. We should, we should give them a Christmas present. Like, I don't know, candy canes or- Candy canes? No, what? <laughs> You're gonna spike their blood sugar. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, how about sugar-free candy canes? That's a great idea. Yeah, you, you are sharp, dude. <laughs> Dad, there's a monster under my bed. There's nothing under, wait, a mirror? Ha ha ha, I got you! Get it? You're the monster! Uh, Dad, where's your reflection? Repeat after me. I can do this. I can do this. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm done eating fast food and drinking alcohol. I'm ready to burn some calories. All right! You surrounded! Come out with your hands up! Say please! Please, please what? Please come out with your hands up. Pretty please? This is degrading. Just say it. 
Pretty please come out with your hands up. With cherries on top. Pretty please with cherries on top. Come out with your hands up. Say thank you. Say sorry. 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 And remember kids, if anyone harasses you, you just say, stop it. I don't like it. And that's the end of that. Stop it. I don't like it. All right. Let's stop it. I don't like it. I'll see you in class tomorrow, guys. Give me all your fucking money. Give me all your fucking money now. Stop it. I don't like it. Uh, you're lucky you know that one. Not, not everyone knows that one. You know, you're lucky. Oh, Jesus, thank fuck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your pilot speaking, and I have news, so let's start with the good news, and that's that, um, you guys get to be on the news tonight. Derek, how was your test today? Not too bad. I got an F. That's, that's bad. Okay, then bad. Pretty bad. So you failed your test? Yep, and then Miss Henson gonna say she wanna have a one-on-one -on -one with me. Oh, okay, so she wants to- Fight me. What? She wants to fight me. No, she wants to have a- she wants to sit down and teach you. She wants to go over the lesson one-on-one. -on -one. Oh. I pushed her old ass down the stairs. Holy shit! Oh, man. She never got up. She never got up. Dad, can I hang out with Tommy today? Uh. How was this a yes? No, no. Jeez, okay, no. Louder. Jesus, no! Tommy, I'm sorry, bro! Hey, dude, what are you doing? Oh, hey, nothing. Uh, I'm doing nothing. That's the most suspicious nothing I've ever heard, but it's true. What's behind that door? What? What? This one? Yeah, that one. Air? Uh-huh, what else? More air. All right, I'm checking. Whoa! Oh, no, no, you cannot do that. You cannot do that. Why? Uh, because it's, uh, it's really embarrassing. All right, cool. I'm your best friend, so I'm sure you'll be fine to show me, right? Okay, good. Ah, no! If you check behind this door, our friendship is at risk. Whoa. Okay, now you're freaking me out. What the hell is behind this door, dude? It doesn't matter, okay? Just please leave. Yeah, you don't have a choice now. I'm checking. Sister's boyfriend keeps stealing your Calvin Klein underwear. Well, here's how you're gonna get them back. Step one, you're gonna tell your sister it's your pet turtle Tyson's birthday. You wanna go bowling this weekend to celebrate, and she should come and tag along too, and bring a boyfriend, Lamar. It's gonna be a turtle-tastic time. Step two, everyone arrives and gets ready to bowl. You look over to Lamar and say, I'm hungry, I want a hot dog, you feel me? Boom, Lamar turns around to grab your hot dog and you immediately sprint over to a bowling ball. You fill one of the finger holes with industrial strength, quick drying super glue, and pass it back to Lamar. Quickly, Lamar, it's your turn to bowl. Lamar loots is the bowling ball. His body attached by the super glue flies along with it. Yeah. You let onto his trousers and underwear like a fucking hellhound and use his own momentum to tear them from his body as he flies. Boom! Then, look. You just check the label of his underwear, see if they are yours, and if they are, you take him on home. Well done, mate. You just got your pants back. What's your problem? No problem. That's my problem. And what's the problem? I'm a problem solver. I need a problem to solve. Okay, your finances. Did you solve that? Oh, yeah. No problem. Okay, well, do you get enough sleep at yeah. night? No major insecurities? Yeah. You're happy with your family yeah. life? You're healthy? Yeah, done. I've solved all of those. Well, you've solved all your basic problems. Now you need fulfillment. But I got my fulfillment solving the basic problems. Then why aren't you fulfilled? Because I ran out of problems. Well, that's problematic. Probably. No, definitely. That is a problem to solve. What is having no problem to solve? Well, how do I solve the problem of having no problems? Well, that's not my problem. It, what's your problem? You have one more wish. One more wish? I, I don't even know what to think of. Dude, think of all the good we could do with this one wish. World peace, end world hunger, no more war? You're right. Genie, I'm ready for my last wish. Go on. I wish for an anime girlfriend. Get the fuck on the ground, buddy. I'm not gonna say it again. Get on Cadet. the- What? They called us here because he's about to jump. Oh! Oh! Grandpa, Grandpa! What's that, Sonny? I found a nickel on the ground. Well, that's just wonderful. 
Remember to put it in your piggy bank. I also found a key buried in your backyard. Oh, uh, well, don't pay no mind to that key. Uh, Grandpa doesn't know anything about that. And then I found an abandoned shed that the key unlocks. Oh, uh, that, that sure is strange. And then I went in the shed, and I found a hidden door that leads underground. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be doing that now. And then I found a shotgun, and a bunch of skeletons, and one of them had Grandma's clothes on it. I miss Grandma. Uh, me, me too. Crazy how she just, uh, disappeared like that. <laughs> and then there was one guy that looked all tired and hungry, and he begged me for help. Well, what'd you do? I shot him. Well, that's just wonderful. All right, everybody, if you um, follow me this way, um, if you look to your left here, you have somebody that is supposed to be doing their homework, but is instead scrolling on TikTok. Um, go ahead and take your pictures, and then we're going to keep moving on. Let's fight. Let's go. You'll lose. Oh, yeah? And why is that? Because you were forsaken at birth. What? Oh, oh, oh. You don't understand, do you? No. Your kind will never prosper. Hey, what are you doing? Oh! What is this? What have you done to me? I am a genie. You have three wishes. Wow! I have the perfect wish. So this is my girlfriend and she's blind, but we've been together a long time and I just wish she could see the world. So I wish my girlfriend could see. You know what? That's a pretty good wish. Done. Wow! Well, Wait, Gabe, that's what you look like? <laughs> you are not my type. Ooh, he's cute though. What's your name? Hi, I'm the genie. I'm Katie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So what are you doing later? All right, you get three wishes, but there's three rules. No bring anybody back from the dead, no making anybody fall in love with you, and I can't kill nobody. Wish spiders had wings. There's four rules. Sir, I'm sorry, but we're going to have to ask you to leave. Why? Do you really want to know? Yes. Your vibes are off. Look, that cloud looks like a freaking potato. Hey, look, that guy looks like a fucking loser. Oh, Come on. All right, we need you to release the hostages without harming them. Well, our clients want you to give them the money and let them escape. I'll handle this. Hey, what if we doubled what they're paying you? Will you stop? I'll take care of this guy. What if we tripled your salary? Would you stop? Yeah, nice try. You said triple? Hey, wake up. You're free to go. What? Why? Somebody bailed you out. What? But I don't... I don't even know anyone. Who the fuck are you? Emmett? Okay, Emmett, did you bail me out of jail? Yeah. Well, why? I wanted to show you my hat. You bailed me out of jail because you wanted to show me your hat. Yeah, I just bought it. Wasn't my bail like $20,000? 25 So do you like no, it? No, not really. No. Fuck. Repeat after me. I can do this. I can do this. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm done eating fast food and drinking alcohol. I'm ready to burn some calories. All right. All right, describe yourself in one word. Tired. Fuck, can you do that? Well, well, it, it says here you're good at mathematics. So what's, what's 69 times 420? 37. That wasn't even close. Yeah, but it was quick. Fuck, you're hired. You're a bitch. I know. Hey, boss, uh, I was just wondering, am I getting that promotion we've been talking about? Oh, Steve, uh, of course. You're my best employee. Steve's definitely not getting that promotion. What? What? You, you just looked at the wall and said I wasn't getting that promotion. <laughs> no, I didn't. I totally just did that. Uh, you did it again. Did what again? Okay, now you're just playing dumb, and it's really pissing me off. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yes, I did. And if Steve's pissed off about this, he wouldn't want me to tell him about me eating his lunch. <laughs> what? You're the one who ate my lunch? How many other things have you not told me? Nothing. I swear, that's it. That's definitely not it. I was also the one who wrote that's what abortion is for in his truck after his son came out as a furry. You wrote that's what abortion is for in my truck? Seriously? Go ahead. Tell me something else. I guess I shouldn't tell him about how I slept with his wife either. <laughs> Honey, 
just kill it. It's a spider. He's looking at me right now. We are making eye contact. Take your shoe off and whack it with your shoe. Honey, he can hear you. He can understand what's going on. He is hyper aware of what's going on right now. Don't be dramatic, dear. It's a spider. Stay back. Stay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to, to scare you. Honey, just kill it. You don't understand what's going on, okay? Please, <laughs> Mrs. Please don't kill me. British. I have 300 children and another 169 on the way. I, I'm not sure if that makes me want to kill you more or kill you less. Please don't squish me. I'm a simple spider. Are you seriously talking to the spider? You have no idea what's going on, okay? He's a... Shit. Holy shit! Honey, there's a huge spider in here. Please, mister. I have 300 children. Is it a pistol? Oh, God. All right, class, let's do an icebreaker. Let's go in a circle, say what you want to be when you grow up, starting with Timmy. I want to be a firefighter. I want to be a lawyer. I want to be dead like both of my parents. Okay, let's take out our books. Let's do some reading. What's up? We're just going to act like he didn't just say that? Hello? Okay, what do you want me to do? Call his parents? Hey, good morning, Mom. Mom? Uh, are, are you okay? Good morning, sweetie. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were- I thought you were mad or something. You didn't take the trash out last night. No, I didn't. Well, you're probably just tired from school. Yeah, that's true. But it's summer vacation. That is also true. But we all make mistakes sometimes. Give me a hug. You're, you're hugging a little tight, Mom. But you never took the chicken out the freezer. Sorry, your stepsister's not going to make it. Oh god, no. I meant she's not going to make it to this meeting. Oh right, of course lol, because she's dead. Okay class, listen up. Today we are going to be talking about the fitness gram. Hey, hey dude, dude. What? What? So yesterday I just woke up with the ability to read anyone's mind. <laughs> no way dude, what? I swear, just watch, watch, watch. Uh, look, Jacob over there, watch this. Penis, men, gay sex, balls, guys, wrestling, soccer. <clears throat> okay, well, that was no surprise. Um, uh, who wants? Who wants? Let's see. Ah, uh, what about that quiet kid? Ah, uh, yeah, Richard, Richard. Run, run. Man, look at this fucking guy running. What the fuck are you running for? Somebody chasing you or something? Oh fuck, we're chasing him! Wait, what did you say was wrong with me again, Doc? Like I just said, you have short-term memory loss! <laughs> no, I do not. Yes, you do! <laughs> yeah, prove it. All right, Simp Nation, that is it for today's video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you made it this far, you already know. Go ahead and smash that like button. Uh, hit it real nice and good for me. Come on, hit it, I'm waiting. You just watched my entire 10 minute video and you're not gonna hit the like button. Tyler. Tyler Martin. Hit the like button. Impossible. We have your family, Tyler. Oh. Yeah, yeah. We snatched them in the middle of the night while you were sleeping, Tyler. Oh, that's not true. You never noticed. Mom! Now hit the like button. <laughs> Imagine if there's actually someone named Tyler Martin watching this right now. That would be crazy. All right, guys, uh, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed Hey. Hey, dad died. His hair. But dad's bald. His arm hair. Oh, and, and mom's leaving him. Go out with his college buddies tonight. He hasn't seen them in ages. Okay. Oh, and, and your ex-girlfriend texted me. <laughs> what? She's been missing for six years. Well, they found her. Dead. Oh, and I nearly forgot. I'm going to jail tomorrow. Oh, sorry. <laughs> to visit Uncle Bob. Oh. Yeah, they're giving him the lethal injection on Monday. What? What? Why? Do you not remember? You replaced all the water in the house with poison. <laughs> that only kicks in when you spit it out. <laughs> Seven times. Hey, teacher. When are we actually gonna use any of this? You? <laughs> Never. Hey, look, it says gullible on the ceiling. It's very funny. No, it does. Have a look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm serious. It says gullible. I'm not falling for I'm it. I'm not joking. It actually says gullible. Just drop it, alright? I swear to God, just have a look. I'm not looking. Just have a look. No! I think we need a break up. What?
Why are you late? Yeah, remember when you told me yesterday that the bell does not dismiss you, I dismiss you? Yeah, what about it? Well, if the bell does not dismiss me, it does not tell me when to get here on time. Get out of my class, Ryan. Why? Because I was five minutes late? You weren't even in class yesterday. I know, but that's not important. Well, yeah, it is. It's way more important for you to be here than us. The substitute gave you homework yesterday. Put it on my desk on your way out. I finished it in class yesterday. I put it on your desk. Ryan, why are your answers from question one all the way to question eight exactly the same as Michael's answers? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because we were answering the same questions? Can you believe this? Oh, by the way, toss me a pencil. Hey, no talking to each other during class. Why are you teaching during my conversation? That's it. To the principal's office, now. Fine. Can I go to the bathroom on the way? What for? To open the chamber of secrets. What do you think? Out! Everybody down. This is a stick-up. Hey, boss, this old lady isn't getting down. Take her out. But, boss, she's just an old lady. I said take her out. I'm having a wonderful time. Sir, what about this kid? Take him out. Wee. Boss, what about this baby? Take him out. I'm the baby. Top six ways to tell your friend you're in love with them. Number one, take him for a drive. This way the setting is just you and him and the intimacy is at an all time high. What's Ask him to create something with you, whether it's a video, a TikTok, a song, any sort of creative thing will get the juices flowing. I don't, I don't, what, what's Number five, when the scene is set, it's time to make your move. Just go for it. Put all the balls on the table and just go for it. Hey, whoa, hey, Max, what are you, hey? And just like that, you're in love. Because it worked. Because it worked. So my gym crush just got here. I think I'm going to go ask her if I can have her phone number. Um... I'm nervous, but I'm gonna go shoot my shot. So, can I get like, can, do you want like, do you want to have my num my phone? So this kid just like gave me his phone. Come on, man, who drunk the last of my Hawaiian punch? I knew something was gonna happen to this. That's why I pissed in it. Something wrong, Gary? <laughs> I got only four hours of sleep last night, whereas I got 13 hours of sleep last night. What's the difference? Nothing. We're both tired. Absolutely fatigued. Well, move over, idiots, because I'm you if you got the recommended amount of eight hours of sleep. And I am exhausted. Oh, I? Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to do at this point. Loading basement. Oh my god, Kyle, where have you been? Two NPCs to my left. What did he say? Ever since his mom died a month ago, he's been in denial. He thinks he's in a video game. Kyle, I know it hurts, but you have to come to terms with your mother's death. I am aware NPC 179 has despawned. Uh, no! She's dead! Oh. Deceased! Health has decreased by 10%. Kyle, you're not in a video game! NPCs have become self-aware. Initiating creative mode. All moving. All moving. My first question. Are you the killer? No. Really? Yes. Kill us, what? What? Got him! We got him! Guilty! Guilty! What? Are you kidding me? Okay, this is the last straw. Anything to say for yourself? Hey, what's up, Ben? Oh, hey, buddy! Oh my god, are you okay, buddy? Oh, oh, do you need me to call 911? Buddy? No, Curtis, don't die! I love you! Like a friend. Hey son, can you uh, take out the trash? Oh yeah, mom, of course. Let me just uh, finish up this essay real quick. Huh, I asked you to do one thing, but it's all right, it's cool. But when I'm dead, buried, deceased, gone, you gonna miss me. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hey mom, let me introduce you to my girlfriend. Hi, it's a pleasure to finally meet you. <sighs> I, you couldn't find anything better? Hey mom, leave her alone, all right? I love her. Shut the fuck up! I was talking to her. Mom, it's Grandma. Are you gonna knock the next time you just come in my room? You know what? That was rude. I'm sorry. Uh, let's try again. Now you can come in. Okay. Grandma's having a heart attack. <laughs> I just miss him so much, man. It's okay, man. He's in a better place now. Hey, guys. What's going on? His dog was killed in a hit and run yesterday. <laughs> I guess you could say his dog is... deceased. Yes, he's dead. Where was the joke there? I guess you could say I was... Right. 
Is he okay? Don't worry, he does his thing with everyone. And the thing is, is what he's saying isn't even punny. It's just always true. What year is it? <laughs> Guess you could say it's 2020. What's the passcode to your phone? Guess you could say it's uh, 8351. Well, damn, I wish my girlfriend was honest about that one. True. Guess you could say she's cheating on you. What? Hey, don't worry, man. That, that one can't be. With who? Guess you could say it's uh, Matthew. Is that true? Um, it is! What else are you hiding from me? Guess you could say he uh, killed your dog. Ooh, ooh, what? Guess you I could say back, I ruined this friend. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. I'm a This place is pretty creepy. Whoa, I found a note. Whoa, was that blood? There's a lot of writing, but the last sentence says, Oh my gosh, it's here. Something about family. It's running towards me. Ah. Uh... Wait, he wrote ah as he was screaming? I guess so. Oh my god, dude, that's definitely fake. Yeah, you're probably right. My name is Mark Harris, and if you're reading this, I'm already dead. However, luckily I've spent the last five years teaching myself how to write notes under extreme stress. Now it's finally coming in handy. Unfortunately, I've now developed a weird quirk where I write out everything I'm doing as I'm doing it. All I know is that whoever finds this note will be able to save my family before the beast gets to them too. All I know is that my pregnant wife and unborn child will be safe. And I know whoever gets this note will ensure their safety. Oh my god, it's here. If you're reading this, call this number to warn my family before it gets to them too. Oh god, now it's running at me. <laughs> Who wants to play uh, Two Truths, One Lie? <gasps> Ooh, me. What's that? It's basically where you tell your friends two truthful statements and one lie, and they have to guess what the lie was. Uh, here, I'll go first. Michael, uh, my favorite food is pizza, I hate Game of Thrones, and I love Fortnite. <sighs> uh, the Fortnite one's a lie, because you hate Fortnite. Yeah, you got it. That one was too easy. Ooh, okay, my turn, my turn. All right, go. Uh, I hate anime, sometimes I speak to myself for hours on end, and I'm the one who ran over Michael's cat. Well, obviously you didn't run over Michael's cat, so... Yeah. Ha! Wrong! Yes! Ah, what a piece of cake. Too easy, guys. Jimmy, that's not okay. You ran over Michael's cat. <laughs> yeah, what the hell? Oh, 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 I got another one. Uh, no, I think we should stop now. Uh, I really... slept with your girlfriend. I poisoned your drink. And our old friend Sam didn't really go missing. He's actually buried in my backyard. Oh, wait, I did that wrong. Oh, thank God. All three of those were truths. You know, I really like this game. Dad! What's up, buddy? There's a demon under my bed! No, there's not. Would it make you feel better if I checked? Mm hmm Alright. Oh, hey, Frank! Brian? What's up, dude? Yo, I haven't seen you since I was like 10, dude! You're still working for the big man downstairs, I see. Uh, you know me, man. Listen, you mind laying off my son off there? He's a little bit of a post post. Oh, that's kind of cute. I like that. You call him your son. Yeah, he's the mailman's kid. You didn't know that? What do you mean? Yeah, dude, I was actually there. I was waiting for your daughter to come to sleep so I could scare her. But instead, I got Mrs. Moans a lot and mailman Steve making a paper boy right above me. All right, man. All right, man. Yep, nothing there. You're good. Are you sure? Hey, Billy, you want to play Naked Twister? <laughs> yeah, well, no one cares about your fat, ugly kid. I care about my fat, ugly kid. Yeah, well, then why in Dick's fuck is he eating store brand chips? <gasps> Get over it! Where did you get those? Samson's house! Who the fuck is Samson? My friend! You don't have any friends! Alright, I got it at the grocery store! You went without me! And I'll do it again! Oh my god! Okay, so someone stole your water bottle at the gym. Well, here's how you're gonna get it back. Step one, you're gonna strip naked, go to the showers, and lather yourself up in shower gel. You're gonna need a lot, so head to the lockers, check if any of them are still open, and grab as much shower gel as you can. Step two, you're gonna lock every single door inside of that gym. Now, you need to be quick because you're naked, but I believe in you. Step three, you're gonna light a match and hold it up to the smoke detector and then scream fire yeah, fire everyone's gonna burn alive boom the staff will now set up the sprinkler system in the ceiling so this should quickly soak the ground and everything around it now step four you're gonna lather yourself with the shower gel underneath the sprinkler system run as fast as you can and dive into the ground you smash into their legs at 60 miles per hour causing them to fold and crumble before you you then grab your water bottle with one hand and use your other hand to grab a piece of gym equipment and swing using your momentum out of an open window and you then land perfectly on both feet water bottle in hand and walk yourself home. Well done, my friend. Mission complete. <laughs> oh, come on. Boys don't cry. Have you seen the baby? No, I think he got outside. You fool. No. 
No! No! Let me... Ah! I am depressed. Suddenly, pineapples. This does not help. No, Susie, don't walk in the road! Look, Mom, I made it! I am a Stegosaurus! Invisible Billy Adventures! Hey, Billy, catch the frisbee! B Billy? Feeling carsick! <laughs> I sentence you to jazz. No! Hey man, what the oh, what the hell is wrong with you? Level up. Somebody help me! I'm being robbed. I'll save you. Tree powers activate. Die, potato. Yes! Hey, get out of my sandwich. No. High five. Hundred. No! Who's there? The door! Knock knock! Who is there? A mirror! I am lonely! I wish people would be nice to me. Your wish is stupid. Sir, is this your car? Nope, it's yours! <laughs> hey, did you know that carrots are good for your eyesight? You lied to me. Ooh, a puppy! Oh, careful, honey. He has a knife. Oh, what? No, no, I don't. Hey, you got a license for that? You'll never take me alive! Bye, world. Okay, Jim, I'll see you around. Where are you going? Oh, oh, no! Oh, that's not what I thought he meant by that at all! <gasps> There's something on your face! <laughs> it was pain! This is a robbery. I want to be a pie! Billy, no! Quick, shoot me in the face! Good news, we were able to save your legs. And here they are. You're fired! You can't fire me, I quit! You can't quit, I quit! You can't quit, you're a frog! You can't frog me, you're my wife! I'm not your wife, you're my wife! Oh, hey, honey, how was work? Pretty good, but I quit my job! You can't quit your job, you're fired! Ah! Hmm... This is not my arm. Hey, your chin feels nice. Say those three words fast. I ain't stupid. Say it. Alpha Kenny but Say it fast. No. Let's Say it fast. In a restaurant. Alpha Kenny but <gasps> I wonder when he'll get here, dude. I'm so excited. Me too. He's always wanted to be surprised for his birthday. Oh, that's him. Get down. Get down. You know, you guys left the door unlocked. Does he know? No, there's no way. And unfortunately for you, there will be no stealing today. Oh my god, he thinks we're robbing him. Let's just get up and show him it's us. Okay. And don't even think about getting up quickly and bolting for the door. I've got two snipers locked onto your positions, and the moment you move, they won't hesitate to end you. What do we do? We can still talk. Let's just tell him it's us. Also, speaking will do you nothing, as I have noise-canceling headphones in, thus to prevent you from persuading me. I've been expecting this, you know? Which is why I rigged my entire house with explosives. And don't even think about calling the cops. They can't help you where you're going. This is where you die! This is where your pathetic life finally comes to an end! I wonder how it feels knowing that this is- Oh, my voodoo doll of mom! Yet yeah, totally throw, it never worked anyway. Ow! What the hell was that? Oh, keep! All right, son, this is a lie detector. It's gonna beep every time you're not telling the truth. So I'll ask you again. Were you at school today? I already told you, Dad. Yeah, of course I was. You sure about that? Okay, okay, okay. I went and had a beer with my friends. You see, this is the kind of behavior I'm talking about. I was never drinking at your age. <laughs> well, I guess he really is your son. Honey? What the f- Please let me into heaven. And why should I do that? Because of what Candace said. C candace Who's Candace? W what do you mean, Candace? Candace, dip in your mouth! 
It was a pretty good totally one. Totally worth it. Your ex-boyfriend won't log out of your Netflix account. Here's how you're going to get him back. Step one, you're going to text your ex-boyfriend and ask him what he's wearing because you just booked two tickets on a summer-loving boat cruise and he's going to need some shorts, sandals and a fun-loving attitude if he's going to come along with you. Time to rekindle your love. Step two, you arrive at the boat, grab some pina coladas, and then look your ex-boyfriend in the eyes. You idiot. You really thought I'd want to get back with you? Boom. You then jump out your seat and boot your ex-boyfriend in the chest so hard that he flies into the Indian Ocean. You cry out of the top of your lungs. Boom. And watch as a 60-foot blue whale swallows up your ex-boyfriend like a little bit of cheese. Bye bye, motherfucker. Boom. Step three, you simply go back to your ex-boyfriend's house, sign out of your Netflix account, and make your way home. Well done, mate. Justice has been served. Johnny and Marissa sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. First comes love, then comes marriage, then comes an abrupt and tragic miscarriage, then comes blame, then comes despair. Two hearts damaged beyond repair. Johnny leaves Marissa. And takes the treat. D I V O R C E. Did you know that you are more likely to enjoy a TV show if it's based on something that you don't have? With that said, I want to talk about one of my favourite TV shows. I'll reveal to you who the killer is with hard evidence if you give me full immunity. I don't know. Well, I'm your only lead. <sighs> Fine. Full immunity. You're a free man. Who's the killer? Me. Fuck! Emma Jean was a prankster, and I'm sure we will all fondly remember her knack for practical jokes. Well, I remember this one time. Ew. Oh, Did you just fart on my you wife? On my Did grandma. you just shit on your grandmother? I'm proud of you, son. What? No, that wasn't me. I didn't fart. Oh, grandma, you bitch. How long do I have, doctor? A month at best. But on the bright side, you're lucky that you have these moments. Little Jimmy here is going to die in three days. You think you're f***ing better than me? Think you can beat me? Watch. F***, he's Hey, are you, are you okay? Um, my dog died. Ah, oh, fuck, this is awkward. Like, what do I say? Fuck, I'm so sorry, or that must be so hard for you? Fuck, I'm so hard for you. God, what the fuck? Okay, sir, you are here for the daycare job. Uh, first question. Okay. <clears throat> do you like kids? I love them. Okay, that's enough questions. Um, you can, you can leave now, and, and we'll give you a call. Mama, I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Son, don't say that. We're not gonna let this COVID take you away, alright? You, you, you will have to fight. Please fight for me. Okay, Mama. Alright, I'll fight for you. Thank you. What's this I hear about you missing 81 days of school? Uh uh, don't die. Don't die. Don't. 911, hello, I think my friend just died. Okay, I understand. First things first, make sure he's dead, okay? Okay, I got it. <laughs> okay, now what? What the fuck? Hey, Dad, I just got a five headshot kill streak. Oh, wow. I'm proud of you, little man. Good job. Thanks, Dad. So you're gonna let your child play those types of video games? Yeah, so? Aren't they a little too violent? Yeah, but it's not that big of a deal. I'm not gonna let my child grow up as a prude. Hey, Dad, I just found a cool sword and I started chopping people's heads off. That's awesome, little man. Keep it up. Don't you think that's gonna, like, mess him up in the future? That's a myth. There's absolutely no connection between violent kids and violent video games. Hey, Dad, I joined the cult. Hey, hey what? Now I'm harvesting the blood of our firstborn children to please uh, our masters. Uh, okay, what game is that? Hey, hey, stop, bro. It's just a stupid video game. Hey Dad, now I'm a ruthless dictator. I just convinced my army to commit mass genocide and discover new ways to torture our victims. Uh, okay, little man, it's time for bed. No more video games for the night. Hey Dad, I couldn't go to sleep, but I remember staring into my victims' eyes and watching their soul leave their body. And I don't have insomnia. Are you proud of me, Dad? Dad? Are you proud of me? Dad? Are you, are you proud of me? Hey, do you know what the time is? Time to get a watch. Time to get a new joke. Time to get a girlfriend. I'm working on that! Mom, today the kids at school were bullying me. Oh, sweetie, what? Who? Why? Because I made a card for a girl I like and- Ew, what? Simp? Simp? <gasps> You're grounded. Any last words? If you shoot me, your penis is small. Fuck. Ah, I see. Mm, gotcha. I see what you Let me see. What? Nothing. Okay, class, today we're going to be playing Two Truths and a Lie. It's pretty self-explanatory. You're just going to say two things about yourself that are true and one that's not. Oh, can I, can I go first? Oh, Brooke, you're really excited. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Okay, uh, these are just off the top of my head. Um, I really like strawberries. My dad picked up crack like three years ago. It drove him insane. It tore our family apart. Then he got the death penalty for killing like a bunch of people. And uh, my birthday's in May. <laughs> oh. Um. 
Is is the second one alive? My birthday's in July. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you look for in a man? I don't know. I like a man who's more uncapped, maybe facial hair. Oh yeah, I definitely feel that. Most of the guys I've dated have had like red hair, so I guess that's kind of a trend. For sure, for sure. You have to be athletic. It's a huge thing for me. Absolutely, absolutely. Completely agree. But I'm pretty independent. I'm not really looking for anything right now. Absolutely, absolutely. Dude, you almost forgot your phone. Uh, no, my phone's right here. Then whose phone is this? I don't know. Stop grabbing random phones you see on tables. I, well, it was right next to you. Okay, not everything close to me is mine, dude. What? Not everything close to me is mine. That's pretty obvious, dude. Oh my god, why didn't you tell me, dude? Tell you? This is basic common sense. <laughs> then what do I do with this? Is that a goddamn Xbox? Yeah, what I thought was your Xbox. Since when have I ever carried an Xbox out to lunch with me? Ah, dude, I don't understand why you didn't tell me. Tell you what? That not everything around me is mine? Then who's this? Oh, is that a whole child? Yeah, your whole child. Since when have I had children? I don't know, you get around, dude. You're going to jail. For what? Kidnapping a child? Your child? That thing's not mine! So your mother tells me you're afraid of heights? No, I'm afraid of highs. What? Hello? Ah! You wanna know what I was thinking? We should start referring to your age as levels. Like, I'm level 20. How fucking cool is that? My son died at level 4. <laughs> Noob. I'm losing control of the plane. What do I do? You have to. No. You know what? I'm a good teacher. I'm going to let this guy figure it out for himself. This is a very good learning opportunity. And he's going to thank me later. I believe in you. This is a POV of you and I on a brunch date. No! Oh my god, what the fuck? No! I forgot to mention, in this POV, you just shot my dad in the face. Why would you do that? He didn't do anything to you! Hey, Jake. Congrats on your sister being pregnant. Wait, where is she? <laughs> yeah, thanks. Um, she's just in the toilet. Oh, okay. No worries. Um, any idea what she's having? I mean, not really. She's been in there for a while, so she's probably taken a sh- Hey man, I hear your wife's pregnant. What? Yeah, congratulations, dude. That's awesome. <laughs> Whoa, no, 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 no. She, she's not. Oh, um, are you sure? No, I'm Chris. What did you just say? I don't know. I wasn't listening. Okay, dude, just stay calm. Where's my phone, Chris? I need to call her. Where's my fucking phone? I think you'll like it, you know? The teachers are nice, but the principal? Complete idiot. Do you know who I am? Uh, no? The principal's son. Oh, well, do you know who I am? <laughs> no. Good. <laughs> Is this patient sexually active? <laughs> With your mom. Triple the dosage. But sir, that could kill him. Just fucking do it. Okay, class, listen up. Today, we are going to be talking about the fitness gram. Hey, hey, dude, dude. What? What? So, yesterday, I just woke up with the ability to read anyone's mind. <laughs> no way, dude. What? I swear. Just watch, watch, watch. Uh, look, Jacob over there. Watch this. Penis. Men. Gay sex. Balls. Guys. Wrestling. Soccer. <clears throat> okay, well, that was no surprise. Um, uh, who, who wants? Who wants? Let's see. Ah, uh, what about the quiet kid? Ah, uh, yeah, Richard, Richard. Run, run. Hey, son. Yeah, Dad? Uh, me and your mom need to talk with you, so be in the living room. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll be there. It's just, uh, um, can I finish this game first? I'm so close. Sure, but uh, make it quick, okay? You got it. My time has come. They figured out I'm not the innocent Christian boy they thought I was. What a shame. Years of secrets all comes down to this. It was a good run, but whatever they know about me now is irrelevant. I must use these final moments to my advantage. With only two years till my 18th birthday, victory is practically in the palm of my hands. I've tried my best to be the good guy, but I did what I had to do. I was cautious, but unfortunately nobody's perfect. Why must life be so cruel? Why must I have to face this alone? Whatever happens next is for fate to decide. I have nothing to hide. I have nothing to protect. I am an open book. But at what cost? That we will see. You needed me? Grandma died. <laughs> yes! What? Wait, what did you say was wrong with me again, Doc? Like I just said, you have short-term memory loss! <laughs> no, I do not. Yes, you do! <laughs> yeah, prove it. Can't believe you got another girl pregnant. You should learn from your brother Chris. He parties every weekend and has gotten zero girls pregnant. Chris, tell your brother how you stay safe.
I f guys. You've recently lost someone close to you, perhaps a family member, name beginning with F. Father. Father, yes. He's here with us now. What's he saying? He wants to tell you that he's disappointed. Oh. And also, you left the stove on. Right. How did he die? Gas explosion. Ah. You remember our third grade teacher, Miss Jackson? Uh, yeah, I remember her. Remember every beginning of the class, she'd be saying, here you go, baby, and she'd be giving us candy. I remember them days. She was so sweet. But remember how she'd be helping us on all the tests and everybody in the classroom passed? That's the reason why I passed third grade. She was so helpful. And, uh, remember every time at the end of school, if we didn't have a ride, she always takes us home, but on our way home, we'd be getting McDonald's? Ooh, I remember that. She was so, boy, she was like a mother to me. Boy, I love her. But guess what, though? What? She did. Why you had to do all that? The fuck is that? Well, that, that there's some muscle milk, cow. Ooh, Jesus! Oh, look at the size of that udder! That is no udder. The last person who takes the right hand off this table wins a million dollars. You guys ready? Yeah. Go. Yeah. Alright, so the rules are... Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> That's your left hand, dumbass! I want to tell him how I feel, but I have this bad habit of always getting nervous and changing the subject. Calm yourself down, and then ask him if he wants to hang out this weekend. Okay, fine, yeah. Hey, Peyton, I have a question. Do you think your grandma suffered when she died? Shit, I'm not getting any service. You? Of course, damn it. No juice, phone's dead. I just smashed my phone with a hammer. Guys, my phone's a book. Aww. What's wrong? It's gone. What is? My tarantula. Okay, was it in the jar when we left the house? Well, yeah, I was just feeding it. Doris, find the spider. Paul, I'm trying. Doris? Don't stress me, sweetie. Uh, where were you feeding it? On the sea. I have a phobia for spiders, you know this. Paul, just calm down. Oh, God, oh, man. Look under your seat. Oh, Look under God. daddy's seat. Oh, man. It did, it's not there. Oh, Sweet, does it have God. a name? What can oh, we call it? Man. Oh, God. Fred, okay, oh, man. Fred. Fred. Oh, Fred. Give me a Fred. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, Fred. man. Oh, God. We finally found Fred, and we managed to put him back in the jar with chopsticks, which is how I was able to bring him here to show everyone today. Oh. What episode are you on now? I'm on episode two. Oh, that's not so bad. In season five. But you just started yesterday. Yes. Hey, yo, you think we killed everybody? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. I don't know. What about this one? Shit, he looked dead to me. We gotta make sure he is. Hey, tickle his feet, cuz. What? Tickle his feet. Are you serious right now? No, I'm serious, bro. Just tickle his feet. Trust me. All right, man. <laughs> oh, he alive. No, wait. He, hey, wait, shoot wait, his wait. ass. You will need to be seated in a brace position. Oh fuck. oh fuck, Dave. Hey babe, can we talk for a second? Uh, Jerry, I'm gonna have to call you back. What is it, babe? There's something I need to tell you. What's going on? I'm pregnant. Hi, pregnant. I'm dad. <laughs> That's the funny thing. You're not. What? Who's the father? Jerry's the father. Huh. Apparently, girls talk in a higher pitch when talking to a person they're like. Really? Hmm. <laughs> No way, that's so funny. Hang on, let me call you back. <laughs> hey. If you press that button, it'll take one year off of your life. But you'll get a hundred thousand dollars. Dude, stop! Stop it! <laughs> can you arrest me so I can sit with my best friend? Dude, shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up, it's not even a joke anymore, bro. It's never been a joke. Are you, are you guys, you... Hey, bro. Yeah, bro? Close your eyes, bro. Okay, bro. What do you see, bro? N nothing, bro. That's my world without you, bro. Bro. Your friend tells you to do something? Uh, you're not my dad. When your dad tells you to do something? Dad? You came back. Son. Just pass the fucking remote. Hi, what can I get for you? Hi, can I get the chocolate banana smoothie? What's that one called? Um, the Choco Fun Time Banana Rama Buzz. 
<clears throat> and what can I get for you? Yeah, could I just get this one here? Sorry, I don't have my glasses. You're going to have to tell me what it's called. I killed JFK. We got it. Please, please. On your head. So, what's your zodiac sign? Well, I'll give you three guesses. Oh, that's so something a cancer would say. Not a cancer, but keep guessing. Uh, really, you really seem like a cancer to me. Uh, nope, I just said I'm, I'm, I'm not a cancer. Uh, are you sure you're not a cancer? No, I was born in January. Are, are you trying to tell me something? You have cancer. Come on, get up. Let's fight. Let's go. You'll lose. Oh, yeah? And why is that? Because you were forsaken at birth. What? Oh, oh. Oh, you don't understand, do you? No, your kind will never prosper. Hey, what are you doing? Oh! What is this? What have you done?